So on my son's wrist, so on my son's wrist, who is a first grader, or going to be a first grader when school starts, six years old, um, he's got small little wrist. There is one tighter spot left, but it fits on it nicely. There's plenty of overlap for as he grows. Again, I can grow into a full size. He'll probably still be able to use this rest if, uh, if uh, 10 years didn't wear it out. And again, just the lightest little tap, and it pops open. But it does not have a spring closed. You have to push it forward. It taps. It's all a matter of preference. Mine's a, a different kind of trigger that I usually use, but this is the blackout. All right, there's a look at it. All right, so anyway, that's how it fits on my hands as an adult male large. So yeah, definitely for uh, kids and ladies. I also pre-moved it out. Uh, it comes all the way down, but you can release the screw and extend it. So it's extended as far out as it goes. This doesn't. This is the max length, and I think it'll work. But anyway, um, when it comes, this pe it's all the way down here, so it's much shorter. Perfect for uh, people with small wrists, uh, maybe ladies with smaller wrists as well. And stop tilting it, son. And um, for kids. All right, let's take some shots. All right. So I've got my arrow knocked up here, and how this works is there's no spring to keep it closed. It's actually a spring to keep it open. So you'll close it on there, and then I keep your finger behind the trigger, pull it back, and then you just tap it, and it'll open up. So you get just light, just tap. It's barely touching, and it pops open, okay? Okay. Okay. All right. So again, my son's filming today. He's my cameraman. does feel different than, you didn't turn the camera down there, did you? Usually I fire a true fire release, it's got a hooked trigger, I can curl my finger around, it keep clamp shut, and then I squeeze the trigger. So I'm used to this kind of trigger, whereas my son's trigger, again, you just tap. So I'll take another shot with that. Um, I like the trigger, it's a nice release. Uh, I heard someone say it's not good for kids because it's so sensitive. Um, if that's the case, your kid shouldn't be shooting with a release, huh? She's just using their fingers. But anyway, keep it behind the trigger on the release. And both arrows are, their veins are overlapping. So even though I don't usually shoot this, I've only shot about 25 arrows with this release. I like it. It's a good price. Uh, this, it's, it's basically like a house brand of a, of a bigger brand. I'll leave the names off. But again, really nice release. Son likes the color, and again, it fits the adult male. But really, really why I got this is for my boy. He's been using a Velcro one that was way around his hand for adult size, way too big, so this will fit his hand much better. Go ahead and push the red button, son. Thanks for filming.